kiddo. <laughs> she talking to herself? She's all right. She's okay. Teeny's cool. Okay. <laughs> No, 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 I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just Holy smokes. oh, jeez, she's talking to invisible people. Oh, okay, yeah, here we we're here at MegaCon. You're catching a few moments of some fun as, uh, well, we get ready to interview Kyle Starks. He's here at MegaCon Tampa all weekend long. I am. It's crazy. Here I am in Florida once again. And he's been here before, and he we let him back. We let you come back. I know. I must have passed all the blood tests that they made me go through. Yes, yes, the yes. gauntlets, uh, the skeleton wars. I did it. Now, you're known for quite a few books now. You yeah. got under your belt different titles, right? You sure. got you got the, and I'm going to try to get it right here, Rock Candy Mountain. That's correct, from Image Comics. There you go. And we have to move over to that little comic book called Rick and Morty. Yeah, I did Rick and Morty. I'm the Rick and Morty comic book boy. I'm their stepdaddy. <laughs> and you have other material, too. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Rick, Rick, everyone just wants Rick and Morty. I, I have a new book, Kill Them All, just came out. It's very good. From Kill Oni. Them All. Uh, I'm doing Dead of Winter, which is about a dog fighting zombies. It's very good from cool. Oni Comics. Uh, I'm a real-life comic book boy. I have many comic books. Now, you, obviously, you love comics since you were, like, oh, little. Yeah. yeah, sure, sure, sure. And, and you're living the dream? Uh, uh, sure. Yeah, okay. It's a dream. <laughs> now, how do you manage to do all these? Because you're on a, it's monthly, right, with Rick and Morty, right? Uh, Rick and Morty's monthly, Rock Candy Mountain's monthly, Dead of Winter's monthly, uh, Kill Them All just came out as a 180-page graphic novel, Sex Castle is 220. Basically, I just work all the time. You must. I, yeah, because I write and draw uh, Rock Candy Mountain. I write and lay out every issue of Rick and Morty. I draw every fifth issue of Rick, Rick and Morty. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I'm just always working, but that's that's what you do. That's how you do it. Is it, even though the workload's heavier, is it easier being the writer and artist because you kind of have it right here in the head what you want it to be? It, it's interesting. It's it's faster just to write it because you're not as invested, I don't think. Uh, someone else carries so much of the weight for you. But when it comes to my stuff, the creator-owned stuff, the the... There's so much more weight for me for it to be exactly the way I want it to be, which is easier because I'm both the beginning and the end, uh, but it's it's more work even if I just wrote it. Does that make sense? Gotcha. Um, because it has to be what I want and not necessarily me recreating something for somebody else. Whoa. Okay. I, know, I don't know. Now, you will be appearing again in Florida coming up real soon. Month of November. November 4th. Yes. I'll be at the Daytona Beach Toy and Comic Con. That's right. And November 5th, I'll be at Hall of Heroes in, in Jacksonville. Jacksonville. Okay. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And I'm doing something Friday night That's at Gotham right. City Pizza. Wow. I'm busy, man. That's a pre party. Yeah, yeah, it's a pre party. But I, I'll be selling stuff, I think, is the deal. So <laughs> come and give me money. Get pizza, give me money. And one, I know you get, I've, I've been next to him before at Highlander Novelties, and I, I witnessed tons of people asking you questions about Rick and Morty. I'm going to ask probably a question you've been asked 100,000 times oh, already. No. What is the hardest character for you to sketch? Uh, the ones I don't know. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, like, I, if, they're, if, they're, if they're in the new season, I've literally only seen them once, so to speak, right? So I couldn't do any of the Vindicators. I couldn't do a single one. I have no idea what they look like. I mean, I know what they look like, but I'd have to get my phone out. Uh, Phoenix person, I've drawn one time. I don't know what that guy looks like. He's in the show for five oh. seconds. Um, so the general the answer is whomever I've seen the least. Otherwise, Beth is difficult because her face structure is different than everybody else's, um, but also because no one ever asked for Beth, so. Okay. Is Pickle Rick way Pickle up Rick. there now? Pickle Rick is, yeah, he's, yeah, yes. Yeah, okay. Yes, everyone wants Pickle Rick. Okay. He's the new favorite. Okay. Get your sketches. Get your comic books. Meet this guy. Hey. He is extremely fun. He loves comic books. I do. Yeah. And I love people buying comic books. Yes. And come out to MegaCon Tampa Bay. He is here Saturday and Sunday. Please. He's lonely right now. And he'd love to meet you. Please. Come hang out. Let's, let's talk about stuff and give me money. And we look forward to seeing you also at Daytona Beach, Florida, for multiple dates he'll be at. You can check our website for more information, also our Facebook page, and, the, and also the Daytona uh, Beach page for more, too. So find all those things. We have all those links. Kyle Starks, he's one to talk to. Megacon, come on in. He's right, right in the artist alley area, the professional artist alley. Hey, bro, comic creator, Kyle Starks. Yeah. Woo! Riley and Kimmy show.